I'm going to apologize for the lateness of this video today. As you can see, I am a shambles. Oh man. I'm having allergy problems. <laughs> Walking. You should see me go upstairs. It's. But you know what the main thing is? I finished. This is my medal for the Chicago yeah. Marathon. Um, so we start off the beginning, uh, or we got up at like 5.30 in the morning, and Dorian filmed a little bit. Mm -hmm. And I was amped to go, I was ready to go. Um, ran into someone who recognized me like right as I was walking in, which was really cool. The door and let me off. I got like emotional. It was insane the amount of people. Like I sent out an Instagram. Thousand forty Happy people. Thousand people. <laughs> we get started with the run, and I'm going like a you know a decent pace. I'm I'm running my pace. The coolest part about this whole run, besides finishing, is there's 1.7 million spectators. It was so cool to go through each part of the city, like. You know, went through uh, Chinatown and there was like a dragon head doing the wobble or whatever. And I'd say every like six or seven miles or so, I'd see him and my dad and my mom and they would cheer me up. At like mile 13, I was like, yeah. I mean, you texted saying you're at 15K feeling good. Yeah. Which is nine, ten miles. And then I went through Boys Town. <laughs> And I, for some reason, I was in Boys Town. I was like, oh, I want to run through and say hi. Because I don't know, like, th that community is so supportive of me. And so it was like, hey, and like a few people recognized me. And then there was like a trans trio. These guys, these burly dudes dressed in dresses. <laughs> and these burly dudes dressed in like cheerleader skirts, like on the other side. Like, then I'd say I got to about mile like 17 or 18 in this run. And my legs started to shut down. Like, I, I just had this big, oh, just stabbing cramps just like all through my legs and I was like oh my god I still have like nine oh, miles gosh. to go I can't even imagine how am I gonna do this like how am I gonna make it through this I'm gonna lose my mind yeah but I had to finish I had to finish yeah, I trained did. so hard for this I was telling you that too I was like do not stop <sighs> I couldn't stop I was not going to stop so I just kind of like I tried to keep going at a slower pace then I had like one mile marker there was a girl who was handing out water and she was, oh my god, Chris, oh my god, she was <laughs> screaming, and I was like, oh. And I think I tried to grab water from her, but I missed, I was, I was out of it. And then I got to about mile, like, 21, I think, and uh, there was just this guy standing in the middle of the road, cheering everyone on, and there wasn't, like, a lot of people oh. around him, there wasn't a lot of people around me, and he was just like, hey, Chris. <laughs> just, like, so nonchalant, like... I acknowledge that I know who you are. That's so cool. <laughs> and I hope you have a great run. Guy. That guy was so memorable. <laughs> and I'd say right around that same time, my lungs stopped working. Because I'm asthmatic. Not a lot of people know. It's not like serious, but it's stress-induced. So I've, my body was a little stressed out. I've been running for three hours at that point. <laughs> and so uh, I couldn't breathe. My legs started to hurt. So I just started negotiating with myself. I was like, okay, I got to make it to the next... If I make it to the next like aid station, I can have water, walk for 30 seconds... Um, but going along the way, and there was actually so many Daily Crew people that were, like, cheering for me, and you guys cheering for me, and the whole city is cheering for you, just for being a runner. Yep. It, it kind of kept me going, and I did not hit my, uh, the time that I wanted to. I went out too fast. You know what? I didn't train properly. My nutrition wasn't on point. It's mm -hmm. my first marathon. Honestly, just happy to finish, and when I finished, I had to stop myself from crying from both pain and from pride. Like, I was so happy to finish.